YouTube, James here. Um, today we're going to be making a tegu cage for our friend Lene. And we got mostly all the big cuts cut at Lowe's while we were there. So just have to make some minor cuts here and there. And, um, we'll get the cage start built, started. But um, also, Pops, you watch this. Thanks again for letting us borrow your truck to pick up this. Um, couldn't use our truck. Has a flat and too lazy to get a tire for it. But all right, YouTube, let's start the build. All right, we got the boards cut to the exact length. Granted, we just had Lowe's rip them to 36 inch. And granted, they were a full four by eight sheet, so we went through and cut all of them because she wants this cage to be 77 inches. So we got them cut that way and right now we're putting on all the edge banding. All right, we got the banding. You need to make sure that it's smooth and clear of any dirt and debris or sawdust mostly. So got that. And the one and only time a man sits here and uses an iron, I would have to say for myself, it's a good thing I had an iron. Because I sure don't own one. And all the iron does is activates the adhesive to bond it to the sheet. And you want to always apply some pressure. They sell a roller for this, but I just use a nice smooth piece of wood, give it a good press, and then this tool here is for cutting off what access of the banding might be on top and bottom. Hit the corners. And that's the steps on putting on the edge banding. All right, we have all the edge banding on, as you can see, got it all glued up and drilled, pre-drilled, screwed. So got the box for it made and if you watch my channel, um, on the update of everything, I was saying how I was going to do the tracks a little different, and... It's on the bed of the truck. Oh, this one is throwing stuff everywhere. So, as you can see, just one nice big dado. Here's the track, set in, fits perfect, and then hopefully this might since the wood expands and contracts and how was saying some of the problem of it gets tight, the doors and whatnot. So hopefully this will help. And so this is the top track and right now had to take my little fence off the radial arm saw to put this nice big fence up since the bottom board for this, since it is for our friend's Tegu, and to hold substrate and all that, they, she wanted a big lip, so gotta run this through the dado. And that's why using this one as a fence, that way it could stay nice and flush up against this fence. And that's the progress on it so far. All right, and now 
got all this dadoed and ready. It's just clamped in the center brace. Everything looks pretty good where it needs to be. And mailman just came and dropped off the vents. This is what we were waiting for. Five inch vents and got my five inch hole saw. And for the vents that are going in, the way to cut them out, that way you don't get tear out on one side is came to the back, drilled already almost halfway, and then come over to the front and drill the front out and you'll get a nice clean cut on it and the vents will sit in here like that nice and pretty and that's progress so far That's why I didn't want to do that. And that was all the holes drilled. Fix your face. Okay, and after got the holes drilled, Got the electrical for the fluorescent bulb that's going to be UVB hooked up. The spotlights for the heat bulbs and they move in any direction so could swing it around. Christine made this hide. We just have to finish it, get the rest of the sides of exposed melamine covered up and there's going to be slate up here so we're going to make a border around here and then the slate's gonna sit on the inside a ramp and then right now I just got one coat of white on the 2x6 and 2x2s or yeah 2x8 actually and then 2x2s and pretty much just gotta wait it's kind of tacky in some spots but just gotta wait for that to dry and Got to go through and caulk all the seams on the inside, and that'll pretty much be the wrap of the video. And YouTube, you have a good day, and remember like, subscribe, comment, and see you in the next video. Okay, YouTube, cage is all built, it's done. Light fixtures, the electrical setup. I'm enjoying my enjoying my new house. <laughs> the, I think um, the Dagu will like it. Christine made a cool little hide. I'm gonna try it out. Woo! Very nice hide. Very very nice. <laughs> Looks good in there. Looks good in here. And have a good day, you two. Poop. It's the poop. It's amazing. It's amazing poop.